County governors have now a task of settling pending bills left by former administratives in respective counties countrywide. But the bone of contention sits between genuine bills to be paid and corrupt deals in contracts yet to be settled. Game Member of Parliament Elisha Odiambo has challenged the new Siaya County Government Administration led by Governor James Urengo to subject all pending bills to forensic audit before settling them. More importantly, you have a lot of pending bills. Before you pay those pending bills, subject them to a forensic audit. Subject them to a forensic Okay. Odiambo at the same time has challenged Orengo to get to the bottom of a 600 million shilling graft at the county government, adding that the devolved government owed Kenyans an explanation. Let that money, let that money not go direct to the pocket of individual or individual. Because the people say, I don't have medicine. In the hospital, what they have is only Panadol. <laughs> and I ask of you what you can do for the people of Sierra are two things. One, Sierra referent, uh, referral hospital. Do a new building. Do a new hospital. So that even me, if I'm sick, I can go to Sierra for treatment. Speaking at Hawinga Village, the home of Deputy Governor William Odwool, the legislator says most of the pending bills could be fictitious and the public risks losing millions to unscrupulous ex-county government top officials. There was a lot in papers six months before we went to election of 600 million that was stolen. Please tell Kenyans, especially people from Sierra, where did that money go to? We have you have the benefit that you have money alone and, and the colleagues who are in the assembly, they can help us interrogate and get to the bottom of it. Let that money, let that money not go direct to the pocket of individual or an individual. Odiambo, who retained his seat during the just-concluded general elections, says the public still demands an answer to a 600 million shilling loss that was reported six months to the general elections. He says that the new administration that was sworn into the office last Thursday must not allow individuals to benefit from the public coffers when the county hospital had no drugs. A report by the Controller of Budget Office shows that both executive and assemblies had 107.12 billion shillings in eligible bills out of the total of 139.5 billion shillings between June 2020 and March 2022. Counties only settled 15.9 billion pending bills out of 155.5 billion shillings, leaving 139.9 billion shillings unsettled. For Ebu TV, Amode Francis.